welcome to part two. And for part two, I'm going to start over here as my uh, regulator uh, wall clock. This one, um, it does now still run too fast. But for the rest, there were not really, wasn't really anything uh, wrong with it. This one is just working. There was nothing wrong with it. The owner of it said that there was something wrong, but apparently nothing. The vision tail clock had a lot of problems. It chimes still a bit slow, and it did not run. But uh, it is now run. I can't see it. But it's just likely the same problem with my standing clock for running. I did just try something and it did suddenly run. So. So yeah, it does now run, it's super nice, but it still runs slowly, that's the only thing I need to fix. My Dutch Sense clock, this is actually my first F clock, not here, but on my grandma. And it didn't run, it was also out of beat and you know, those kind of problems. And this is the first clock where I actually did know how to fix the out of beat. With how to get a clock to uh, beat correctly. So, as you can hear, it, it is not fully on beat, but it does run, and that's 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 the most important. So yeah, the timing was nothing now uh, run. It was slow, but it's now uh, we it's uh, fast again. Yeah. Over here I have my Jauge and my other Jauge, my Westminster and my uh, yeah, Bim Bam. I'm just gonna leave it like that. There was nothing wrong with these two. You know, only the Jauge Westminster was running a bit slow. But it, is, but it is running good again, so yeah. My German Westminster was also nothing wrong. I had, this was my first Westminster clock, and um, yeah, it's nothing wrong with it. It's now nothing wrong, wrong with it. So yeah, my other Westminster clock, it um, you know the G uh, chime is uh, it doesn't want to hear ever hear uh, himself. It's just super quiet. That's the only problem I uh, still have. And I did run quite fast in the past, but I think it now uh, runs good again. So, so this is part two of all my fixed clocks. Yeah. I'll see you guys in the next one.